Hey YouTube, it's ICU. Earlier this morning, Apple seeded iOS 9.3 beta 1 to register developers. You can check out my coverage on it, link to on your screens right now if you happen to miss it. And with the beta firmware, Apple released something rather awesome. It's called Night Shift, and essentially it's the company's own version of Flux. For those of you who don't know, Flux is a jailbreak tweak that basically modifies the color warmth of your device's display at night, so it's easier on the eyes. Now before we get into this, I'm going to read through Apple's synopsis of Night Shift on their iOS 9.3. Point three preview site. Quote, a lot of waking hours went into thinking about sleep. Many studies have shown that exposure to bright blue light in the evening can affect your circadian rhythms and make it harder to fall asleep. Night Shift uses your iOS device's clock and geolocation to determine when it's sunset in your location. Then it automatically shifts the color in your display to the warmer end of the spectrum, making it easier on your eyes. In the morning, it returns the display to its regular settings, pleasant dreams. So while this is absolutely great and something that I've been waiting for Apple to implement out of the box in stock iOS for so long, it is such a blatant ripoff of Flux, but I love it, so let's get into it. I'm going to open up the settings app here. We're going to go inside of general followed by about, and I'm just going to show you guys that this is indeed on iOS 9.3 beta. So down below at the bottom for the version there, you'll notice again, this is on iOS 9.3 and that's the corresponding build number. So let's just go ahead and tap back out of that. And what we have to do to actually enable night shift is just launch up settings and then go to display and brightness. From there, of course, you do have your regular brightness slider, but what's really interesting is directly below that. We do have a blue light reduction toggle there. And when it's toggled off, we can actually just mess around with the slider to get a quick preview of how it will look once it's enabled. And then when we let go, it will just return to its regular blue light emission there. And we can actually set a schedule too. So if you have your schedule set to off, then you just can manually enable or disable blue light reduction just inside of the display and brightness settings there. You can also set it to from sunset to sunrise or even a custom schedule, but the sunset to sunrise one is exactly how Flux operates. Again, as I mentioned, when actually going over the iOS 9.3 preview section, it actually determines your location based off of geo data. So from there, it will determine when the sun is actually setting in your location at that specific time, and then it will turn it on or turn it off accordingly. So let's go ahead and back out there. I just have it set to turn on at sunset. We're going to set it to the absolute warmest possibility there and we're going to go back and I'm going to give you guys a quick demonstration just by going inside of settings general and we're going to go to date and time I'm going to uncheck set automatically and I'm going to make it a time when it would actually enable so as you can see I set it to 831 there and boom it automatically changes the color warmth of the display this is absolutely great I am so stoked that this is now native inside of iOS what do you guys think let me know down below in the comment section be sure to give this video a huge thumbs up if you're excited and if you want to learn how to install iOS 9.3 on your device right now and you're not currently jailbroken because of course that would really be the only time you'd want to install it then you can check out my coverage on it I will have it linked for you guys in the annotations on your screens now as well as down below in the more info it will be a direct link to my iOS 9.3 beta install guide, which again is part of my earlier coverage that I mentioned toward the beginning of this video. Now, if you guys wanna be updated more often, such as when I release new videos, similar to this one covering various things, ranging from iOS updates to even jailbreaking, just be sure to click the subscribe button below next to my channel name, like me on Facebook, and follow me on Twitter. And until next time, this is ICU, signing out.